Today's Five Things You Need to Know is brought to you by Power Credit Union, proudly serving Southern Colorado. Good Thursday morning, November the 5th, and I'm Bree Groves with your News 5 update. Here in El Paso County, we're now at level two safer at home restrictions, but as COVID numbers continue to rise, there's now discussion about either moving into level three or just returning to those state home orders. The statewide map now shows El Paso and Pueblo counties marked as needing mitigation. Pine Creek High School is transitioning once again to e-learning starting today after another person on campus tested positive for the coronavirus. We don't know if they're a student or faculty member, and they do hope to return to that in-person learning by November 19th. Drivers, a heads up, if you're headed to Uenta to southbound I-25, you do have to wait for that green light. This is the last ramp metering light to be activated in phase one of the I-25 metering project in Colorado Springs and then construction for phase two starts next year. Looking ahead, News 5 will be partnering with Mount Carmel for their annual fundraiser Hoedown for Heroes event this weekend. It is going virtual because of COVID-19. We are going to have coverage all throughout the weekend leading up to the telethon next Tuesday. And you can also tune into News 5 all throughout the day tomorrow to find out more about the event and how you can get involved. Now to your forecast with meteorologist Sam Schreier. Forecast looks nice. We're going to have temperatures with sunshine in the 70s. I don't think there will be a ton of wind out there, but we will have some more wind through the region. And then when we look west a little bit, we'll be in the 60s. Now, over the next seven days, here's what we're looking at. Temperatures are going to dip through the weekend, and we're going to pick up a lot of wind. There is going to be a chance for kind of a rain to snow on Sunday morning between like 4 to 6 a.m. And then as we get out through time, we're going to do our best to kind of keep those rain snow showers around. Pueblo is dry but windy through the weekend, and then we could see some showers out there on Monday. Thank you for listening to today's five things you need to know. Sponsored by Power Credit Union.